What's up everyone, Jake Bender here coming at you with another video. Today I'm going to do a full day of eating, vlog style, day in the life kind of video. We're starting off outside, it's absolutely gorgeous out here, um, but this video is going to be a little bit different. So I'm going to start with um, last night, the full grocery haul of all the food that I'm eating, and then move into the actual full day of eating. Uh, video and what I consume on a bodybuilding diet 10 days out from my competition So hope you guys enjoy this kind of video. Please leave a comment like and subscribe it Helps reach more people. I appreciate each and every one of you without further ado We'll get into the clip from last night in the car driving to the grocery store What's up guys? I'm gonna take you with me uh, to the grocery store and just kind of walk through everything that I get on a diet and we're starting a little prep for peak week just to see how my body responds to everything and I thought I would bring you guys along show you everything that I buy this is a very highly requested video people are always asking me um, what I'm eating on a diet so this is my diet to get absolutely shredded diced whatever you want to call it um, it definitely works as you can see from my progress so far, we're down about 23 pounds from when we started. Uh, we started at 193, well not we, I, I started at 193, and this morning I hit 170, so that is the all-time low for this prep so far. Um, but yeah, we're gonna bring you along and I'm gonna explain everything that I'm getting. And uh, this will be the first part of this video and then we'll move into the actual meals. Um, of what I'm cooking and all that good stuff. So that's the plan for this video. I hope you guys enjoy. These groceries get expensive to help your boy, support your boy. Use use code Bender on BPN products. I appreciate all you guys. And now we will flip to the grocery store. When I go to the grocery store, I start with all the produce, fruits, and vegetables. And then I go to the protein, and then I go to rice cakes and anything else I may need after that. And just do a full circle until we end up back at the front. I get to swipe my card and spend all the money. First thing we're getting is some bananas. Six cucumbers. Basically, with every single meal, I have 100 grams of cucumbers at least. So we stock up on those every time we come here. And we're gonna start with the produce, everything we need, and then move into our meats. Skippy peanut butter. This has got to be one of my favorites uh, things in the whole world. I mainly now put it on either bananas or rice cakes, so that will be some of our fats that we're eating throughout the day. And one of my other favorites, chocolate rice cakes. Lots of eggs. And more eggs, but liquid egg whites. grocery haul it was a total of 115 something so not terrible but we just went to the grocery store two days ago so as you can see bodybuilding is expensive you have to eat whole foods good ingredients healthy foods which are always more expensive and for I guess tomorrow I will be doing a full day of eating video I'll explain my macro breakdown for the day also per meal what i eat how many grams of what and all that kind of good stuff so this is the grocery haul portion of the video and then we will catch you guys tomorrow when we do the full day of eating 
day in the life kind of video and all that kind of good stuff so what's up guys what's going on good morning welcome back today is gonna be day two of this video we just started out with 50 minutes of fasted cardio we did an incline walk uh seven percent incline on 3.5 and yeah it's a beautiful day i'm gonna take you through a full day of eating everything that i put into my body on a daily basis so i can train hard um, and get super lean for the show we're 11 days out now so here we go we're going to move into the first thing i take after cardio As you can see, we just had our strong reds and strong greens through that in about eight to 10 ounces of cold water. Drank that, now we're sipping on some coffee. Um, you're gonna spend a lot of time eating and all of that out here today. It's finally gonna be 80 degrees, so the warm weather is here. After this, we will move into meal number one of the day and then continue on from there. So um, I do work a nine to five and I spend most of my days sitting uh, just in the other room working from home so just keep that in mind as we go throughout the day there'll probably be a lot of uh, just me in the kitchen because it's back and forth every two hours eating between working so those are where I spend most of my days right now so we will move into meal number one now so meal number one of the day we have two whole eggs we have 112 grams of lean ground turkey and we have 26 grams of cream of rice so every single meal is weighed out it has to be perfect at this point so not the stereotypical breakfast by any means but when you're competing and uh, you know on a bodybuilding diet you're not really eating for taste you're eating for fuel and that's exactly what this is so I'll put all the macros here below, but this is meal number one of the day. Um, we have five meals in total. So meal number one, this is what we got. Meal number one is complete. I'll rate this a three out of 10 on taste. It's not that good uh, to be completely honest with you. There's a lot of bland flavors and foods in there. Um, fullness, I'll give it an eight out of 10. I'm pretty full right now. Um, this will lead me uh, into meal number two. So I'm eating every two hours right now. And yeah, it is nine o'clock, just had our first meal, and we will eat again at around 11 or 11.30, and then uh, yeah, continue on for there. All right, y'all, time for meal number two. We have 140 grams of chicken breast, we have 108 grams of cucumbers and 24 grams of peanut butter. So that is meal number two. It's 11.30, uh, so just over two hours since we ate last. Just like that, meal number two of the day is done. The third meal will be coming up again in two hours. Um, it'll be pretty similar, however, substituting turkey for chicken. Um, but yeah, we will catch you in two hours for meal number three. All right guys, so it is midday. Um, we are actually cooking up meal number three, which is going to be ground turkey. What I like to do is just cook up uh, two to four packs of ground turkey at a time. That way I have it for the coming days and I don't have to cook it every single morning or night, uh, whatever it may be. So this is what I found to be the easiest. I throw it in a Tupperware put it in the fridge and then every time I eat, I'll just weigh it from there. Um, super easy and sustainable way to, to make sure you're getting in all your protein uh, and not missing a meal. So highly recommend meal prepping, get everything in bulk and just put it away until you need it. Just a little background. So for the last two months or so, I've had five low days, five low carb days, one high carb day and one rest day diet. And that's kind of how we've broken it down. Uh, how my coach has split it up for me. And then today starts the pre-peak uh, week diet. So 
all of the food has been the same. We're just altering quantities a little bit to see how my body's gonna react next week leading into the show day. So I bring that complete package in fullness. Um, also with the, the lean waistline on Saturday, next Saturday on show day. So that's kind of how everything's breaking down. Three. This is also the pre-workout meal. So we have 168 grams of ground turkey, and then we have four rice cakes, lightly salted with 24 grams of peanut butter spread evenly across them. Um, definitely a very little amount, but this is gonna be the pre-workout meal. Like I mentioned earlier, we're going into a leg day. Get some carbs in to fuel the workout, some protein, and yeah, that's that. No number three. Macros here. Shake macros here. Better background. I briefly mentioned that before, last two months, I had a low day, high day, and rest day diet uh, in terms of carbs. So I'm just going to kind of explain what the, that process was and what we're doing. So what we did there was just change the carbs. So the amount of carbs that I was consuming each day. Protein remained around 230 grams per day. Um, the low day carbs was 105. The high day carbs was 220. And the rest day carbs were 95. Um, fats remain pretty much the same between 55 and 60 grams per day and yeah that was pretty much what i was running for the last two months that is what we found to work with my body still giving me enough energy to work out and get through my workouts and push a you know significant amount of weight but also lose a pound and a half a week um, so i started this cut january 25th around there um, at 193 pounds this morning I weighed 172 pounds, so uh, 21 pounds lost so far um, over these last uh, 13, 14 weeks, whatever it was. Um, but yeah, and we still have a week to go, so super lean right now. I, I have never been this lean in my life. I'm seeing veins in places I didn't even know I would be able to, uh, all across my abs and chest. and all these different places, but uh, it, it's been a very humbling and rewarding uh, experience so far. So praying that the uh, the actual show day goes well, that we get the result we want. We're shooting for the win. Anything less is gonna be disappointing, but hey, it's a first show. I mean, I think right now we have a pretty, pretty good package coming in, so. Um, meal number three is complete. Now it's time to go tan. Um, been tanning the last week and a half or so, uh, late to the game in that regard, but uh, trying to catch up and uh, get as dark as possible before the spray tan, um, which will be the last little thing that I do the day before the show. So, meal three done, about to go tan, hitting legs, then we'll come home, have dinner, then we have a VPN team call tonight at 8 and then as soon as that wraps up at 9 I will have my last meal of the day um, but yeah here we go we are going to move into the next part of the day alright guys just got done with our tan um, the things we do to get bronze before the show but yeah, I did, uh, did 10 minutes in there. It's starting to get a little darker. I need to get a lot darker. Have a couple of spray tans before the show, which is really going to help me get that dark glow um, that you see everyone have on stage. But that's done. Workday's done. Now, time to go hit these. Y'all, we just rolled up to the gym. About to hit a dry scoop. Usually don't take pump when I hit legs but we're doing it today we're gonna see what happens making a mess
yeah, trying to get an insane pump in the leg. So one scoop flight, one scoop endo pump. <sighs> Going down, VPN code bender saves you 10%, helps your boy out. Broke my camera, so my screen doesn't work. Run that code up so I can get a new camera. home from the gym post-workout meal pretty similar to the rest of the day it is going to be 168 grams of ground turkey 100 grams of cucumber and we have three chocolate rice cakes with 24 grams of peanut butter spread between all of them we're going to eat this jump on a bpn call and i'll check back in with you for meal number five and the final meal of the day i'll throw the macros right here for this meal Guys, we're gonna eat our last meal outside. This is meal number five, last meal before bed. It is 184 grams of egg whites, two whole eggs, and 108 grams of cucumber. I'm also sipping on a zero calorie blue Gatorade. Uh, but yeah, this is a full day of eating. I appreciate you guys tuning in. Uh, please let me know if you like this in the comments below and want to see it again and kind of see what my reverse dying is going to look like. As always guys, go one more and have a great night.